tech seems so commonplace that we can take it for granted, like the internet. We use it a lot, maybe even without thinking about it. But how does it work? To help shed some light on that, we're talking to Ryan. He's a computer scientist and he knows the ins and outs of the internet like the back of his hand. The internet uh, basically is the set of computers that are linked to each other. Each computer has its own address and because of the addresses, uh, you know, we have to find out ways to actually pass the information from one computer to another. So imagine a whole network of computers all joining to each other. Uh, they could be in different continents, but the thing that is unique about them is that they have their own addresses. And, you know, in the postal system, uh, the postman knows how to bring a parcel from the post office to your house because of its address. And it follows a certain route each day and then it knows how to put the thing at the right place at the right time. So thanks to every computer device's unique address, information is able to know exactly where it has to go. In fact, some devices like routers and switches exist just to pass that information on to another destination. Think of them like little digital post offices. But what if you want to send a slightly bigger parcel, like a picture? Let's say I want to upload a, a photo to some website, socialmedia.com. What happens is it's trying to see where socialmedia.com is. It understands where its current address is and it talks to all the other computers in between to try to find a way to find to, to move this picture that you're uploading onto socialmedia.com into the socialmedia.com computer. And after that, when it's received, the computers from the other end would actually give you a reply and say, yep, we've got it, it's all good now, and then we move on and so forth. All these messages actually are transmitted in the speed of light because all the different cables are optical fibers which transmit light messages. Might be a while until we have a spaceship that can hit warp speeds, but until then we have devices that can send information at the speed of light that fit into the palm of our hands, capable of accessing all the information in the known universe. Or just sending your friend a pic of your doggo. Either way, very cool. Thanks, Internet. <laughs>